and that is absolutely everything that's in the box right there. What do you expect for $4.99? Okay, and there's a list of instructions here. So this shows you how to replace the battery, and it talks about the different functions on here. Rip this baby open. Okay, so the mask itself, oh, comes with a little gel pack to keep it dry. Don't eat this. So right there's where the lights shine at. It shows that right there on the box. So I'm guessing that's gonna be where the blue light comes out at. So I'm gonna put it on real quick just to see how it feels. I've got kind of a big head. I'm assuming that since this is adjustable, it'll still fit me. I'm gonna extend this thing out for my big fat head. I can tell you right now with this thing on, you absolutely cannot see any light whatsoever. Okay, so let's put some batteries in it and see how this thing works. Wanted to show everybody this. I got the battery cover off and there's a battery already in here. So that's a good thing. And it's got one of the strips on there that you pull out so that it activates the battery. So that's a good thing. So I'm gonna go ahead and pull that out. So we've activated the battery now and I'll replace the uh, battery cover right here. Okay, right here it says, function on you're supposed to push this button right here and it turns it on so let's see what happens oh pretty blue so I turned it on there and you can see it's like a pretty blue light and then the next function says press twice to turn lights on for 15 minutes light will flash three times before the timer function starts okay let's try it again Okay, there it goes. It flashed three times, so now it's gonna stay on for 15 minutes and then automatically shut off. So I guess if you just turn it on, it just stays on all night. I'm guessing that most of us, if we're gonna use something like this, we're probably gonna to wanna to just turn it on for the 15 minutes. That way we're not using our batteries up, you know, too quickly. So, you know, the double click, 15 minutes, and then I'd say most of us are probably asleep by then. I'm sorry if you got ins insomnia and it takes you an hour to get to sleep, but you know, um, Thank God I don't have that problem, but I'm sorry for anybody that does, and maybe this will help. So <laughs> this button right here is for brightness adjustment. We'll push that. It says press and hold to adjust brightness. Okay, we gotta hold it down. I think it's actually dimming it. So that's what it is. Oh, there it goes. Yeah, it's just, it's, you know, it's got a certain brightness that it gets to, and then it dims. So yeah. So it's either full blue or it just gets lighter, it looks like. Yeah, that's as bright as it gets right there. And I'm guessing for sleep, that's probably as bright as you might want it. Okay, and that's all the functions that it, set, that it has listed on here. Right here, it says right here that this is a faux suede, and it does kind of feel like suede, and that's comfortable. And this is just kind of like a generic foam right here. And when I put this on, it is pretty comfortable. And I'm gonna go ahead and put it on with the lights on just so that we can, uh, just so I can give you an idea of, you know, what it's like to have it on here real quick. Here, I'll put it up in the camera real close and you can maybe get a little taste of it right here. So, all right, see there? Yeah, okay, I'll put it on now. <laughs> Okay, so it's pretty much pitch black except for the blue LED lights. And I don't know if you're expected to close your eyes with these on or if you're just supposed to look at them. I'm really not sure. Maybe I should look at the instructions. But right now I'm seeing three blue lights on each side. They're actually kind of blended because, you know, they're so close up to my face right now. Uh, is it relaxing? Well, I don't know. I'm not really sure because I'm not in a position right now to go to sleep. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna try to take a nap with these things on and see you know, if it puts me in a quicker state of sleep. And I will give this an honest try. I'll try to take a nap with these on and then I'm gonna try to sleep with these on tonight and just see what happens. See if they help me fall asleep quicker, see if they're more relaxing, see if it helps at all, you know? 
Uh, if the blue light bothers me, I'll even shut it off and just see if the mask helps at all to just to block out just any you know light that's possibly in the bedroom. My bedroom is pretty dark, but there is maybe just a tiny hint of light in there. But as you can see again, there's that blue light. And it is kind of soothing to look at, isn't it? So it's just kind of a relaxing blue light. So it's kind of like looking at some crystal blue water, or maybe some baby blue eyes, something like that. It's very soothing to look at. But uh, I'm going to give this an honest review. I'm going to try to sleep with it on tonight, and then I'll finish this video and give a recap. And, uh, you know, when you're watching this, the whole thing's going to be here. You know, you're not going to have to wait on the cliffhanger. <laughs> um, as if it's that exciting. But, you know, I will tell you, you know, if this thing did help me to fall asleep or not. Uh, I'll also tell you, you know, if it maybe gets in the way or if it's irritating at all. You know, it felt pretty comfortable in my head. It wasn't bothering me or anything. So, you know, we'll see. Focus on the soft glow for 30 seconds to a minute. Then close your eyes. Open your eyes after 30 seconds. Observe the soft glow for 30 seconds to a minute. Repeat until you feel sleepy. Then turn off the soft glow. So they're expecting you to look at this for 30 seconds to a minute and then close your eyes for 30 seconds to a minute and then open your eyes. Um, so it's kind of like a repeat process. Supposedly that's going to help relax you. Maybe it will. I don't know. I know that when I start to feel sleepy though, I don't uh, feel like uh, reaching up and turning something off. You know what I'm saying? I think that if you're sleepy, you might just be sleepy. I don't know. I'm not going to argue with this thing. I'll try to follow the directions and we'll see what happens. Okay, so now I'm going to lay down here on the couch for a little nap and see if I can uh, see if this sharper image mask helps me to relax and go to sleep. If it does, that's a good thing. If it doesn't, well, I'll report that too. So here we go. Let's kick them on. <laughs> 15 minutes of light there, so here we go. Good night, folks. Duke, you gotta let Daddy sleep. Okay, you guys gotta let Daddy sleep. Okay. I'm gonna shoo these guys away and try to go to sleep. Okay, so for the sharper image mask, I did actually sleep with this thing on. With this mask on, I fell asleep very quickly. I fell asleep in probably about five minutes. Um, and to be honest with you, I don't know that the mask helped me to relax because I kind of fall asleep fairly easy anyway, but maybe it did help me to fall asleep quicker. Like I said, I put it on, I looked at the light, like it said to do in the instructions. I closed my eyes, opened my eyes, uh, just like the instructions said, then I finally just closed my eyes and I drifted off to sleep very quickly. I don't even remember falling asleep. I just remember doing the eye thing like the instructions say, and then I ended up falling asleep. So did it help? I think it did help a little bit. I think it actually got me to sleep a little bit quicker. So would this help somebody with insomnia? Maybe, I'm not for sure. All I can tell you is that I think it did help me to get to sleep quicker. And it is, the light in there is relaxing. Uh, it's uh, not what you'd think. you think maybe it'd be like, oh, it's bright, it'll keep me awake. It's not like that at all. It's just a really cool, very, very low beam blue white or blue light. I turn it on, you can see that. It's just a, it's just a real mild blue. I'm not really sure what the science is behind this thing, but it did help me to fall asleep a little bit. Some nights we all, I think, have a harder time falling asleep than others. Uh, but I know that when I wore this, uh, I slept all night. I did not have a problem at all falling asleep. So the mask was comfortable, it fit well, and obviously it keeps all the light out. So that's a huge plus if that's you know what's in your way. And then the blue, the little, the light blue light that's in here doesn't bother you. Um, I think it kind of soothes you in some weird way. Hey folks, I hope you enjoyed the Sharper Image Ambient Light Sleep Mask review that I just did. 
And if you did, please remember to subscribe to my channel so you can come back and watch more of my review videos. If you have any questions about this sleep mask, please throw them down in the comments and I'll try to answer those for you if I can. If you have anything that you'd like to see reviewed, throw that down in the comments as well and I'll try to get around to reviewing it. I want to thank you so much for watching and God bless. Folks, I want to thank you so much for tuning in today. If you haven't yet subscribed to my channel, please hit the subscribe button and you'll be able to come back for future videos. You folks have a blessed day and I hope to see you back here soon.